Hey agents, thanks for tuning into this one. Um, after my I've put up my last build I put up was uh, armor and kill build. Um, so I went back and reworked it a bit, um, and this is what I came up with. I don't want to show you. Um, so this is the armor and kill. It doesn't look much different than the one I actually had, but I made some changes here. Um, I changed this to gunner, where I was first using the um, artificer hive that you get from um, you get from the technician. I was using that to heal the shield, but um, I thought, okay, this is an armor and kill build, um, and there was a comment, um, a buddy of mine commented on the videos, maybe I should try Gunner to get more armor and kill, so okay, I went ahead and, and did it. I knew in the first place Gunner would give me the 10%, but I didn't actually make the build with it. I was I was too hooked on the artificer healing the shield. Um, so what actually I'm doing here is I'm using a three-piece Hunter's Fury, which is quite uh, obvious, it explains my weapon choices. Uh, the two piece gives you shotgun damage and SMG damage, and the three piece gives you armor, that 20% armor and kill, which I'm, which I'm looking for, and you get 100% health on kill. Um, so I'm using the two piece bowstone here because that also gives you armor and kill. Uh, my obvious talent here is my chest talent is intimidate. We all know what it does. Um, what intimidate does, you could actually, or like what, uh, you don't actually need to use a memento in here at all. Uh, but I use the the bowstone, my second piece bowstone for the 10% armor and kill for the brand seed bonus. I use the knee for that, and they have crit damage and crit chance. And like I said, you crit damage and crit chance there on the. Um, on the chest as well wherever I can um, the same I didn't show you that this fury pieces but this it's the same idea here um, I went for crit damage so I could change the core attribute from weapon damage to armor to armor core so I went for crit damage and crit chance where one where I could and then I changed it to uh, armor core so I can have 1.8 million um, you, and the memento is my memento with my crit damage mod on here so you don't actually have to use you don't have to use this at all. I mean you don't have to use the Hunter's Fury, but the Hunter's Fury is quite nice, it gives you twenty percent armor and kills so why not use it? You could actually use a three piece badger as well if you if you want to use something like a Scorpio, you could use a three piece badger. Or you can use um, you can instead of this memento here, you can use the Bellstone Armory. They they also have a perfect blood sucker, that's something you can use. You can use Adrenaline Rush even, Adrenaline you can use that. Or there is a piece here, this um, this name Liquid Engineer, the name Bellstone piece. It has perfect blood sucker. You can use that. Um, I just like using the memento. This is more like a solo build, I have to say. This is not actually a team build because you have to kill the enemy to obviously get the get the armor back. Um, the Crusader shield I'm using here because it's gunner, so I can't use the um, the striker shield. Obviously, I can't use that. This one is tier six comes with all the goodies here um, because I'm running gunner I might as well run the bench the banshee because you get the mods for it I don't know what else to put in here in any case so the banshee there has to be um, like I said you don't need to use memento you could use a three piece um, um, the three piece three piece badger also gives you armor and kill uh, my weapon choices here I'm running a military p416 with a preservation on it Killing an enemy repairs 10% armor over 5 seconds. If you get the headshot, it's additional. You get the extra 10 10% um, armor back. And on this one, I'm using the mop, not the Scorpio. I'm using the mop because it has 10% armor and kill. That's the only... I think that's the only gun in the game we get armor and kill with it. And uh, I'm lucky enough to have Optimus on the gun. Um, so I haven't... Um, it was. I don't see it worthwhile me using the resources to get 12% armor to get the extra 1% and the uh, damage to armor, the extra 1.3% shotgun damage. There's a bunch of resources that I could actually use on other things. Or I could decide later on I want to change the Optimus maybe to something else. Um, I don't know like what, but I think Optimus would be the best bit for the setup here. Um, so let me just show you the stats quickly. Um, I'm going to focus on crit here, but at least I got 46.5 on the P416 with 97 crit damage. Um, there's no talents or anything here to give me crit, um, so that's what I'm stuck with. Uh, let me just go down here. So the armor and kill on the P416 is 708,874. There's no read. I didn't roll any region on here, but I'm still at 17,722. Let me show you the mob. The armor kill on the mob there is 886,092. And there's my region. Let me just go up for the mob. You can see the crit there is 46.5% crit chance and 92 crit damage. Um, the P416 
P320X Compact <laughs> The crit chance 51.5 and 97.5 uh, crit damage uh, Let me just go down to the to the armored kill There is also 708 I'm only getting the 10% extra on the mob because of that um, the talent it has um, and why I'm using the, the gun that's actually part of gunner is also for the perfect preservation um, And the other reason to use gunner like I said it gives you 10% extra um, armor and kill Because normally before I use gunner my armor and kill was with these same weapons was 100,000 less um, So overall I think this build is actually an improvement um, Thanks Gearset Builder um, for calling me out on that and for not using and uh, not being um, being brave enough to go without the artificer so this actually works out well pretty much um, uh, better for a solo build not so much in group um, because if your enemy if your friends on your team they're, they're basically in inverted commas they steal your kill you won't get anything <laughs> so this is uh, the revised almond almond kill version 2 um, thanks for tuning in guys I'll catch you next time